Welcome to another exciting exploration. Today, we are taking you on a journey to South Korea's most breathtaking treasures, Heidong Yonggungsa Temple, located in Busan. To get to this beautiful destination, you can take a bus. The nearest stop is still quite distant from the site, so you have to hike the rest of Ooh, the way. It's a long hike. But I hope it's worth it. <sighs> As you walk up to the hill, you will see lots of food vendors giving the place a carnival atmosphere. Before we entered, we had to make sure the mice in our tummies were well fed. So we tried fish cakes and cheese hot dog. These were the best foods on the street, and I suggest you to must try it. As we moved forward, we entered the sacred area, home to the 12 mystical creatures of the Chinese zodiac, each representing a different year in the calendar. There are other statues and carved stones. At the end of these creatures, there is a pagoda, and at its base, there is a tire for traffic safety prayers. Like seriously, if you want to avoid accidents, you can make a stop here and pray for your safety. From this point, visitors walk down the stone steps to reach the sunrise platform and the western part of the temple grounds. You will pass through a small tunnel and as you keep walking down, you will see the beautiful scenery all around you. We visited this temple during Chinese New Year holidays, so it was very crowded with tourists. Many people also came to perform rituals as they wanted to start New Year with blessings, so we did not enter the main prayers area to avoid causing any distractions. We enjoyed the outside view and explored the first floor of temple. This floor also has a sacred statue and people were also praying there. This area is perfect for enjoying the lovely shoreline. As I soaked in the view, I had a realization that the peace we feel after praying in places surrounded by nature is truly precious. Similar experience we had at Big Buddha Temple in Phuket. So you can check this video and support us by subscribing to our channel. From this spot, you can catch a glimpse of the sunrise platform. Let's take a closer look and explore it thoroughly. During the short walk to the sunrise platform, you'll come across a shrine and a spot where you can get a classic picture-perfect side of Heidong Yonggungsa. As you step onto the sunrise platform, you'll notice the rocky outcrop ahead. And right at the front, there is a golden statue of Jijang Bosal. This spot is a must visit. It's incredibly beautiful and peaceful. The sound of the waves crashing against the shore and the vibrant colors of the sea will captivate you, making it hard to leave. We ended up spending two hours just soaking in the breathtaking view. If you want to see more such videos, then support us by subscribing to this channel.